Perchance AI is a versatile and user-friendly AI-powered content generation platform. It offers a wide range of tools and generators that allow users to create various types of content, including images, stories, characters, poems, and more, all through simple text prompts. The platform is completely free to use, requires no logins or signups, and has no usage limit. Perchance AI leverages advanced AI models like Stable Diffusion for text-to-image generation and uses natural language processing for text-based content creation. If this is your first time here, my name is JI and this is the Everyday AI channel where we teach you how you can use AI in your daily lives. So we're going to dive right into this here and as you can see, we're getting quite a few random sort of possibilities that we could actually do. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go for one of these and let's see, let's go for this. So let me roll the dice a few times and see what we get. Okay, cool. So we've got Spanish man, early 40s, tidy hair, wearing a matador outfit in a corrida, anticipation in the air, close up. Okay, cool. So you've also got the anti-description box, which is really cool. So a lot of these image generation models find it difficult to avoid putting certain things in images if you tell them explicitly. So for example, even if I create an image and I say, don't put any giraffes in it, there's a high likelihood for most image generators that they're still gonna be giraffes because they don't understand the concept of negation. Now, if you're in front of an image generation model, there may be something called a negative prompt, which is probably the same as what this anti-description box is here as well. So what I'll put here is uh, deformities, um, blurs and uh yeah i'll leave that there so these are basically what you don't want in the image now i'm going to select the style i want it to be cinematic the shape i want it to be landscape and i'm going to click generate wow okay cool so as you can see it took a few seconds to generate we've still got a hallucination here it seems that hand looks uh, a bit off this hand as well isn't necessarily the best but yeah these other images are pretty cool as well we can see what the prompt is if we hover over it. Okay, cool. These faces aren't looking ideal. But the best part of image generation is that you can just keep generating until you get close enough to what you want. So this one looks pretty cool. This one looks very cinematic. So this is probably the one that I would use if I was, let's say, shooting a movie. And uh, yeah, I think this is a decent platform for anyone who wants to generate characters for free. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure you like comment and subscribe and if you'd like to talk to me then head over to jay's instagram where you can chat to chat jpt which is essentially chat gpt combined with my way of thinking speaking and seeing the world so if you like these videos then you'll definitely enjoy having a chat with chat jpt thanks a lot for watching have a great day